This is Mike with AndroidHeadlines.com. I'm back to talk more Carrier IQ. Um, like I said before yesterday, my Evo does not have uh, Carrier IQ on it at all because I'm using a source-based ROM. But if you do happen to have um, not have a source-based ROM or a ROM with Carrier IQ on it, I can tell you today how to get rid of it. Uh, one of them is an app. Now, there's actually a couple ways, but here's three ways that I know of or I've heard of. One of them is an app called Carrier IQ Process Killer. And from what I understand, this makes it so you can go ahead and kill Carrier IQ for one time. Just one time while you, um, well, not one time, I suppose, but one time um, until you reboot, I should say. So there it is, Carrier IQ Process Killer. Looks like that. Um, you can download it. It's free because, of course, they don't want to make anything that, well, free is the best way, of course. So um, six people that I am friends with have plus one it, so that's pretty good. 500 plus downloads. And it will basically kill Carrier IQ until you reboot your phone. So that's one option. <clears throat> the second option is to call your carrier. Um, if you're with Verizon and you happen to have it on your phone, um, and you can find out what you can find out if you have it on your phone or not by y y watching the video I posted yesterday. Um, it'll it'll be right above this one, so you can go ahead and look for that. Um, calling your carriers. So if you have a Verizon phone and you happen to um, have it on there or whatever it may be, you can go ahead and call your carrier and ask them what options you can take and they should be able to help you. I've not tested this one yet, so I've just heard it from a couple friends that you can do that. Another app <clears throat> uh, got brought up to me yesterday after I talked about Carrier IQ in the video and posted it. Uh, it's called Logging Test App Pro Key. So, uh, Logging Test App obviously would be the original app, but the Pro Key um, you need a root to do it, so if you don't have a root device, you don't want to do it. And of course, this is only really good if you don't have a ROM. Um, you can just root your phone and then ROM it to CyanogenMod, and they don't have it either because they're source-based. But if for some reason you just have a Samsung Galaxy S or a Samsung Galaxy S2, and you just wanted to root it, but you didn't want to ROM it, you can use this app for a dollar and uh, get rid of it. And that will take care of the, prop, the job as well. So there is three methods to get rid of Carrier IQ. Um, hope they work. Uh, let me know. This has been Mike with AndroidHeadlines.com.